say, hey, before I get into this video, would you be so kind as to subscribe and welcome to those who are joining me for the first time and welcome back to those who are returning. Hey, you know what kind of video this is. This is going to be a wine review and I'm here to tell you we are in holiday. If you didn't know, guess what? We are in holiday. Whether you are celebrating any version of a religion or a faith or a belief or you're just that average person who doesn't celebrate any of that but still has co-workers and a community that you might be asked to bring a host gift, a gift, something, whatever it is, holiday, I personally think it's just a great hostess gift to take a bottle of wine. And you don't want to take the cheapest, two buck chuck, you don't want to take something too high price, ostentatious, unless you know that they are wine lovers. So where does that put you? The not really a wine drinker, the quasi wine drinker, the just want to be able to gift confidently, wine drinker? Okay, today's wine is a great one for any of those situations. If you personally are looking for just a great wine to enjoy on the weekend, this right here is it. This is the Robert Bundavi Private Selection Heritage Red Blend California 2015. You see that? So the thing about this wine is it's right in the $10 range. So this is a decent bottle to gift. If you are being invited over to dinner and you need a hostess gift, this is a goodie. If you are invited to a work function and you need to take something, this is a goodie to take. It's a blend, things to know from the label. Um, Robert Mondavi Private Selection was founded in 1994 by Robert Mondavi. Capture the delicious flavors of California, blah, 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 making wine for 20 years. Here's the thing. The smell is strawberry vanilla. The taste is raspberry strawberry chocolate. Pair it with anything from barbecue to pasta. Robert Mondavi says, drink what you like and like what you drink. Well, I think this one right here is a great choice. I liked it. I had this two weeks ago. I've been kind of behind in getting my wine Wednesdays. So that's why I don't remember the price exactly, but I know it was in the $10 range and I do know that I liked it. And I always like a cherry berry flavor and this is it. And I would call this a medium body. It's not light and thin like a table wine. It's not really robust and heavy in the mouth, something that you would put with a fatty beef. Barbecue to pasta is a great way to just this wine right here and it is the Harvest Red Blend. I like blends. I think you'll like this too. So going forward into this holiday season, just be able to gift and gift confidently. This is a good one. If you have any questions, there are so many amazing resources online, but my favorite thing is if you shop at Total Wine, when I'm in Vegas, I love to go up to the Total Wine there and I love to talk to the staff who work there and they are so knowledgeable and I find that they're not knowledgeable in a wine snob way. I find the Total Wine staff to be fun and they're wine drinkers too and they have their own opinions and favorites and they tend to taste everything that comes in. Uh, boy, I should work there. A little sip of that bottle to let you know if you like it, you don't. Uh, who's the client that is going to like it? Long story short, uh, if you have an opportunity to shop at a Total Wine, do so because the staff is so helpful, especially if you need to gift a wine. All right, everybody, thank you for tuning in to Makeup University today. I like to do a wine review because I think that that wine is a way to relax and rest yourself and add to your inner beauty. Hey, beauty, I'm Cheryl Lynn. This is Makeup University, and remember...